as we know, often there are, um, uh, because of um, differences in madhab or differences in party affiliation, Muslims place barriers between them and their fellow Muslims in achieving the aims that Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala has established in the Sharia. But this is an issue to which we cannot differ upon because this is the foundation of our religion. And so therefore what is required of each and every one of us is not just open words, not just empty slogans, but practical measures to defend this Prophet Sallallahu life and seerah. And then to take the truth of the message of the Prophet Sallallahu and the truth of his life and use every single media means and all sorts of available uh, ways of communication in order to take this to every single person on earth. We must address all of humanity, whether those who are living in the West or those living in other parts of the world. Address them by the way the Sharia commands us and reach every single human being and inform them of who the Prophet ﷺ was and what was his message Sallallahu Alaihi Wasallam. And so therefore this conference uh, can be thought of um, as the spark which will lead uh, to uh, this um, activities and it is upon for us all to gather and assist every one of us in the best of their means as Allah commands us in the Quran that you should gather together and assist each other in righteousness and piety. Um, we need to uh, assist uh, in spreading uh, this message and take the opportunity in turning this uh, issue into a positive one. Uh, and finally, it is f permissible for us also to do comparison and contrast. When we look at the life of the Prophet Sallallahu when he was forced to engage into war, if we look at the wars that the Prophet Sallallahu was forced to engage in, we find that the total number of people who were killed were just a few hundred. Yet the nation from which these preachers come from were able to kill a quarter million people with a single bomb in Japan in World War II. Which of the two nations is more blood uh, letting? Which of the more uh, two peoples are more merciful unto humanity? Uh, so again, the uh, Sheikh, um, to uh, summarize uh, what he was saying, is that he uh, en encouraged all of us to uh, take this matter seriously and to study, begin by let us revive the life of the Prophet Sallallahu uh, not only uh, amongst uh, our fellow Muslims, but introduce humanity to his life, as this is one of the best means of da'wah, because so many people became Muslim during the life of the Prophet Sallallahu just because of the Prophet's character. So when engaging in da'wah, teaching the people who the Prophet Muhammad Sallallahu is, who they have, the Prophet was sent to them specifically, alayhi salatu wasalam, is one of the best means of uh, da'wah and, and the Shaykh uh, concluded by again thanking the attendees and those who set the conference up, asking Allah to bless them all uh, for their, um, uh, their attending this conference and coming together for this noble matter. Wa jazakum Allah khairan.